Hello, everybody, and welcome to uh, a Friday stream instead of a Thursday one, making sure my audio levels are working. Uh, I think I might be a little low on the voice, so let's tune that up a bit. Put the desktop down a little low. <clears throat> Call it a day. All right, so. <laughs> oh, they're playing D&D on Discord. Oh, that's really neat. Well, I hope I hope you guys are having lots of fun in your D&D thing. So. I'm getting the feeling that something might go down wrong <laughs> later down the line. Uh, hey. Uh, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I'm lucky that uh, I live in a community full of extremely old people. So, um, hopefully none of them are also streaming. Because that would probably not be fun. Um, yay. <clears throat> Welcome to uh, another week of quarantine. Another week of a Friday stream. <laughs> okay, so today I wanted to... Uh... Why is it on the bottom? Basically do all of this, which really isn't that much. Um, it's Well, it's, it's more than this, because it's still, it's still ruins. Uh, so how's our inventory? Did we sort this? Nope. <clears throat> Way to go, me. I probably wanted to do this. Oh, shoot, I forgot about Severus. Ah. Forgot to do that. Crap. Um, okay. So should we just... Do that real quickly? Uh, that's gonna bother me for the end of eternity. Uh, I can't I can't just go do the Severus thing right now. Oh boy. Yes, yeah, is it Severus or Servant? Whatever his name is. Uh Yeah, I how how I'm fine doing it over again? Okay, maybe we just do a quick little See if we can get it to work this time. And if it doesn't work, we're just going to have to deal with it. Uh, what save would it would have been? I think I made a save right when we defeated him or close to it. <clears throat> so if it's not this one, it's the one after it. Service. That's how it sounds. Okay. Okay, you guys want to do it just because he's hot. You guys. Oh, God. You horny buggers. Okay, uh, where are we? This is after the fight. Okay, so this one then. Oh, boy. <clears throat> now, how, how do we get it to not glitch? Uh, maybe we should take a different party. Uh, so, still, I mean, we're, we're really just doing it to do it. We don't really need to have a full inventory. Um, because we're just going to pretend we live in a world where this is the canon. Because, <laughs> quite frankly, I just can't be asked uh, to redo all of what we did. Um, so, let's go here. Oh, who did we take? I think we took Dorian and Cassandra. Um, so, I don't think I took Sarah. Uh, I would not have taken Blackwall, I think. And we had def Vivian has not come out of the hole in a while. Uh, we've all been locked up for weeks. Concentrates the thirst. Oh, you kids. Oh, you crazy kids. <laughs> I think Varric was there. Okay, so let's just... I don't know. I, I don't know what causes the glitch. I really don't. So, I'm just gonna bring people that are different this time uh, which I have not leveled up um Sarah I don't know why I'm bothering like I'm, I'm gonna have to redo this like this isn't a canon whatever we just have to wait why is can I click it wait. uh just just enough to like be good uh, then let's take a horse over there. Inquisitor. <laughs> Ironically, Viv's worst fear is irrelevance. Maybe you're not wrong. Did we just... Did you just guys see... I mean, it's kind of in the corner. I don't know if you guys saw, but, like, that phoenix just massacred that one guy. We're gonna go fast. What's the, what's the button for fast? Okay. I always forget what hotkey I made it, because it's different than what it should be. And it's not like it's on here. 
Which you can see what terrible hotkeys I gave these because I never use them. Thank you for heart screen. You're welcome. The glitch always happens to me no matter what. You usually have to save and reload as he's bleeding on the ground. Okay. Let's make a hard save uh, right before we enter. Just to say we have it. That way, if, like, things happen, we don't have to walk all the way back here. Uh, save and reload is bleeding on the ground. Okay, so let's um, defeat everybody, and then we'll save there and see if that, that gets us things. I don't know why. I should probably just, like, turn down the difficulty so we just get this done faster. Quite honest. But I can't be asked to do that at this moment, and knowing me, I'll probably forget later on. Does service have a harem out of everyone here on the street? I, I'm not like a huge fan of them or anything, but like I. Oh what? Was there must be something here? What was that? What was that power? We're all just beating this poor guy up, huh? Is there any other people to fight? Yeah, there's one guy over there taking pot shots. Let's get rid of him, I guess. You should call. The Inquisition was here on his foot. <laughs> uh, let's fight everybody else. Where's everybody else? <laughs> Viv got him. Okay. I didn't think I could get him from, uh, elements. Is that everybody? Okay, we'll save. I can't save. Now I can save. We'll save here. And then... Still breathing. He's resilient, I'll give him that. He's a monster. But I'm impressed he supplied so many operations this far out in the desert. Have some of the troops bring him in. I'll deal with him back at Skyhold. So we'll do uh, some... Ah, oh, man. I hate the... Uh, we'll deal with it. Okay. <clears throat> I do hate that, like, we, we're in, like, an alternate universe. And this isn't going to, like, be in the camp. I honestly... Ugh, man. Part of me just wants to, like, continue on with this universe, and then I'll just redo what we... Ugh, I don't know. I'm torn. I'm very torn. I'm very torn. But we didn't, uh, it didn't, it didn't glitch, so we can at least go see it. Um. You only need to raise your standards. Yeah, I, honestly, I even forget what he looks like, so let's go, uh... Let's go sit in judgment for this guy. Before you is Servus of the Minrathus Circle of Magi. You met him and his venatory in the Western Approach. He admits to working for Corypheus, raising monsters, and using magic for conquest. He also used his connections to smuggle magical artifacts out of the Approach, without his master's consent. Uh, Ashara asks, what went wrong, Katie? I missed it. So last week, um, we did that fight, and then it, like, a, a very common glitch in this game is that this whole deal doesn't trigger, and it didn't trigger. Um, <clears throat> but we were so far into it, I was like, oh, screw it, I'll just do it in between episodes and, like, make sure things, uh, do well. Uh, but then I forgot to do that. Um, so <laughs> now, now we're in, like, this weird state where, like, we're going to finish this off, and then I'm going to go back to where we were at the the end of last stream where this hasn't technically been done but it's also glitched and I cannot finish it um, so there's this weird quantum state we're in where you guys are seeing a thing that will never be um, so <laughs> here, here's what we're doing uh, what do I want to say I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm impressed whether or not he's loyal to Corypheus has no bearing on his crimes. I was hired by a third party. 
I've no loyalty to him. Might you find that useful, Your Worship? I'm sorry, are you attempting to bargain with us? Bargain? I plead. I throw myself on your mercy. I also have friends in Tavinta who owe me large debts. Leave what happened in the approach behind us, Inquisitor, and I can put them all at your disposal. Uh, <clears throat> I am currently searching through my large pile of Inquisition papers on my desk, looking for the one where I wrote down the judgment for this, even though it doesn't really matter. Um, I still want to make the choice I would have made. Uh, so let's see, where is this guy? <sighs> there he is. <clears throat> oh, his first name is Crassius. Okay, so... We have the option to give him back to Corypheus, uh, hire him as a smuggler, throw him in jail, or be an informant. Um, so... Really, Solus approves of really anything we do here, but we don't really need Solus approval. Um, even though I know this is an alternate universe, that's not going to matter. So, imprisonment is stupid, because you just lose a lot of coal, and you don't really get that much from uh, Solus or Iron Bull. Corypheus, giving back to Corypheus, you get a lot of points for Solus and Iron Bull, Blackwall and Vivian, but you lose stuff with Sarah and Dorian. I want Sarah approval, and I want... <clears throat> wow, okay, there really isn't a good thing here. F there, there really is actually kind of only terrible choices for what I'm trying to do with uh, <laughs> with things, to be quite honest. Because no, unless I choose imprisonment, I will get Sarah disapproval. Um, so I might as well, I guess, go for Vivian approval, which is either giving to Corypheus or being an informant. Um... I guess we'll, I guess, <sighs> what do we do? Yeah, I guess to chew, chew, so the informant is kind of interesting, but at the same time, I feel like to make myself feel better, um, because <laughs> the outcomes are essentially the same, except one, he's working with the Inquisition, to like try to make this work with uh, the world state we're about to go back to, I'm going to give him back to Corypheus. Uh, which is the exact same uh, approval status for informant. So, to Corypheus he goes. Corypheus can deal with his wayward lieutenant. Bind him with a note saying what he did and leave him for a Venatori patrol. Maker's mercy, are you serious? No, wait, stop, stop! All right, if nothing, if nothing else, it's fun. Um... <laughs> I, I think if anything, it's like a playful little, like you, look look what we caught your guy doing, haha. <laughs> you you don't know what's going on in your ranks. All right, so uh, we're gonna pretend that totally uh, has happened uh, and is still going on, and we're going to jump back to where we were, which was <laughs> about two hours later in game. <laughs> so loading that up. It's a bit extreme. It's a bit extreme. Um, but, you know. When Cole disapproves, I know I did something wrong. Cole disapproves no matter what, actually. No matter what you do, Cole disapproves in that. Um, okay, let me read off uh, the thing real quick. So, if you imprison him, he disapproves. If you give him to Corivius, he disapproves. If you give him an informant, he disapproves. And if he's a smuggler, he slightly disapproves. No matter what you do, Cole hates you. Or doesn't doesn't uh, like what you did. Um, I should probably also check off that I gave him back to Corivius. And sort of check off that I did the thing. Okay. <clears throat> so. Cole just hates the situation in general. He does. Uh, it's just a bad, it's a bad thing. Anyway. Uh, pretending that we have done that and everything's still hunky-dory. Let's go to the western approach what do we want to do um i'm thinking we kind of take the map and work our way down so then on this little this little marker i made we go do the still ruins and just kind of work our way down from here and that means the dragon will be one of the last things we do which i think is relevant um we do want to bring black wall because of memories of the gray what else do we want to do i think we want to well we actually want to bring varic because of the delirium 
And we want to bring Vivian because of that. So it looks like we're doing Blackwall, Vivian, uh, Varric? Is what we're going to be doing. I don't know if that'll be a dragon party, but that's what we're doing now. Uh, I, we do have to do our inventory, though. That one is non-negotiable. Uh, <clears throat> let's see. So it's a make your son unhappy scenario. Pretty much. Keen machete. Okay, hold on. Uh... Ooh, we got a we got a new. Uh, okay, let's go down to the um, Undercroft, and we can go figure out our inventory situation. And then we got a couple of uniques we can store. Bye, Sarah. <clears throat> not the Undercroft. Not here we go. So, yeah. <clears throat> okay. So, weapons. Uh, we don't... I'm... Oh, I didn't mean to... No, no, no. Wait, hold on. Valuable, so we can sell it. Blizzard's Path. That's new. Carved along the staff's length. Be cold, my son. Empty yourself of compassion. For the Blizzard's Path strikes fear. If you feel raged, let it be righteous. Unleash it, and you will achieve greatness. Well, that's kind of neat. I don't know what that is in reference to, but... Uh, okay. <clears throat> so stabs are gone. Cassandra. Yeah, none of this is amazing. And... Gius of the Order. Some Templar thing. I'm not going to bother reading, to be quite honest. <laughs> Sarah. Nothing else. You had a staff. Uh, call for daggers. Uh, nothing fun. Vivian... Solus, Varric, Iron Bull. All kind of boring. Okay. Armor. So we can get rid of all of this. Do I want to keep Dread? I mean, we'll keep it, but it's the exact same rating as what we could have had. Mas though this one doesn't actually have a story on it. Um, I don't really want to keep it if it doesn't have a story. Uh, well, that one has a story, but it's also just like they all have that. Um. <clears throat> just getting rid of all of it because, frankly, we have better armor. Um, I probably could take off the arms and legs, though. So those might be... Oh, wow. Bull. <laughs> I don't think that looks good on you. Uh, I'll probably rip off the arms and legs on that and then sell it. The accessories. Oh, boy, I forgot about all this. Uh, I, I, frankly, I can't be asked. Um, upgrades. A lot of stuff. Okay. Storage. Inventory. Where's what I want to throw? Deposit, deposit. Uh, I want to put Dread in there. Um, I probably should put some of that in there, but I'm just not going to. And let's go. Okay. Katie, have you found your sleep schedule changing during quarantine? I've been sleeping a lot more personally. Uh, no. Well, mostly because, of, like, Michael's working from home now. So, like, we, we, we've just been keeping with his schedule. <laughs> so, uh, it's, it's, I don't know, it's, it's not been that much. I also f feel like, um, considering, uh first trimester pregnancy I was sleeping all the time I feel like no matter what I'm going to be not sleeping as much as then um so I, I we've been doing pretty good now uh give it a month uh I don't know we'll see what happens then but <laughs> as of right now we're doing okay um oh I thought this had a thing too oh well oops <clears throat> so how's Animal Crossing Katie it's going wonderfully uh I love it to pieces um there's, it's, it's interesting in that it, you can definitely tell it's missing pieces, because that's how games work nowadays. Um, and I kind of miss those pieces. Like, they don't have, okay, I want to sell things. No wonder this isn't working. Um, they don't have some of the furniture sets. Uh, they don't have painting. They don't have a lot of stuff. So I'm kind of hoping that stuff comes soon, um, because I like having that in my game. God, we still have, Oh, we still got stuff. Oh, we do have some runes, though. We could throw on some weapons and stuff, so let's do that. So, I have a rune already. Who doesn't have a rune? Cassandra doesn't have a rune. And she, who I think would do well with a Master Demon Slaying rune. So let's do that. Yeah, that's fine. 
Um, actually, who has a named weapon? I'll probably be better. Uh, do I have a rune for Dorian? Corrupting rune? Yeah, that seems fun. Okay. <clears throat> Does Michael play Animal Crossing too? No, he doesn't. Um, to, be, to be frank, I think even if he wanted to, I don't know if I want to know on my island because I'm so anal about how I want things. <laughs> So, no, he's, he's, he doesn't, his types of games are completely different than what I like. He likes, um, oh, hello. Oh, how long has, how long has that been sitting there? He likes, um, military stuff and he plays with a lot of our college friends. He likes, um, flight simulators specifically for helicopters and he likes, <sighs> I don't know what, it would be called, but I'm going to say micromanaging simulators like Factorio. <laughs> and so like, it's, it's funny, like the type of games I like, he thinks are completely boring and the types of games that he likes, I think are completely boring. Um, so like, there, we have some overlap, like, uh, we played the Witcher three together and that was really fun. Um, I'm surprised we don't have any creature items. We recently finished a game on the switch called return of the Oberdin, and that was really good. And I recommend that. Um, but yeah, no, like we, <laughs> there, there isn't a lot of games we, 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 we both completely like. All right. Ah, uh, so is the video game taste of 14 year old boy? <laughs> That's not true. No, no. He, cause he doesn't like Call of Duty. It's very simple. Like, it's more like the hardcore ones, you know, like, um, I don't know the names of them. <laughs> so. But yeah. <clears throat> Alright, let's go to the still ruins. Uh, we wanted to take Black Wall. Oh, bull. Oh, buddy. Okay. Uh, we're still not taking it, though. Uh, Varric and Vivian. It's one of those people who uh, have, like, us to may build IRL helicopter hub. He well, he we don't, but he does have like pedals, and I think if he could, he would. We just don't have the space. Like tycoon game, nah, I don't. He, well, he doesn't play any of the tycoon games, but like maybe he'd be into them. I don't know. So what kind of hub is he? What do you mean, like you mean husband or hub? I, I don't. <clears throat> He's a very good husband. Return of the... Oh, Arma. Yeah, he does do Arma. There's a He's been really into... Um, he described it as TF2, but it's uh, medieval. Mordhau, I think. He's been into that. Um, get the logging stand that we have been neglecting. Uh, okay, so still ruins. Here we go. Uh, Return of the Oberdin. Uh, it's really wonderful little game. Uh, it didn't take us that long. I think, like, over, we, we beat it over a weekend. Uh, oh, now I actually have to level these people up, because we, we did that in the alternate timeline that doesn't exist anymore. Uh, we'll go this one. Varric doesn't need to. Blackwall. Still gonna not go for the focus yet. Does he even like Dragonite? No, he doesn't. <laughs> he does not at all. Alternate universe, what did I miss? Uh, we, uh, hmm, how do I describe it? So, uh, if you remember last week, we, we missed, uh, getting a thing because of a glitch. Uh, we did get it this week, uh, but it's, it's, is it technically a part of this current save file? So it's in an alternate universe that we did it. Um, so yeah, it's, it's at the beginning of the stream. You can check the, the log, the VOD. Just kind of an empty area. I think there's normally something to fight here, but we fought it, and so it's gone now. Aw, oh, you, you killed- oh, you left me some, some loot, though, so I guess I can't be mad at the spiders. You are attacking me now, though, which is not cool. see here. Go oh, what? Come on now. 
Now there's a cave back here that I think we went into. Uh, cotton. Is there something up here I should be getting? No, everyone's just running back here for no reason. Where are they coming from? <laughs> I believe we came from there uh, last episode. Let me check the map, though. Yeah, because the Forgotten Mines. Yeah, we went there. All right. <clears throat> Speaking of time, you are going into the ruins that is stuck in time? Well, I mean, yeah. I haven't played a Rift Mage yet. Do you like it better than Night Enchanter? I, I do, personally. Because I, I like the, the abilities more. I'm, I'm just not a big fan of the sword. I know a lot of people like that, being up close and personal, but I like being over here. And being able to weaken people. Um. Mosaic. Let's go around and looting all the things before we get out of here. Anything over here? There's something over here. I'm not going to go all the way up for that. <clears throat> More death root. I should really like the Still Ruins quest. Um, the Western Approach isn't my favorite map, but I think it is a good one. Uh... Definitely a lot of fun. Did they honestly think that would keep us out? Probably. <laughs> oh, you made him go to sleep, but... shooting at a wall randomly, that's probably when I'm uh, <laughs> reading the chat and not paying attention to the gameplay. Uh, Alexius has failed. The work here has just become all the more vital. Service. I think that's his real name. He probably is. <laughs> what is this? Uh, I'm not really gonna read all these notes because quite frankly it's just magisters try to do a blood magic ritual guess what it didn't work so they pause time that's the, the TLDR <clears throat> I did the blade of Tyrdenon spelling it turns your staff into a sword basically I know what you're talking about but I also don't know how it's spelled with my night enchanter it was a lot of fun I actually did that once too um, I enjoyed it well enough but I, I still just like being like way over there <laughs> Oh, hey, hello. It's probably best we have uh, the two mages in the party, one of them's a close up mage. That probably helps a lot. All right, let's 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 look around here, see what we have. fun. I don't think this ever actually opens up. It might. I don't remember. <clears throat> the 
that's all that's stuck down there. Hmm. Something to uh, look for later. How old is this temple? Um, very old. I, I don't know how old. I think there is something here that gives us a time frame, but I can't remember where. Let's just keep... Uh... Ah, Divinder's development in the region predates the first blight. Detailed accounts of the location are non-existent, but there's some promising leads. Uh, do not return to Tien. So that's uh, someone who just came here. So apparently this is somewhere before the first blight, roughly. <clears throat> now it wants me to interact with one of these things. On the Everything's frozen. I don't think this is the Venatori. The power required for such a spell would be immense. Time-altering magic. Let's hope this proves less trying than Redcliffe. I hope so. <clears throat> I mean, I know it will, but that's besides the point. <laughs> okay. Man, sigils are just the worst. Sigils are for if you really want to, like, just add an extra level level of difficulty for just fun. I don't I don't know why people would do it. Did I get this one? No, it's just empty or I got it. I can't remember. Shoot, shoot. <clears throat> ah, here's the other side of it. Nothing interesting. There's just to be a lot of stuff we're not, like... That's the one bad thing about Inquisition. If you do everything, you get into these situations where, like, you start looting things, and no matter what you loot, it's going to be kind of garbage. And it kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Sigil of the Giant is the best ever. Okay, there's like one or two that are good, but the rest of them are trash. There's so many that are bad. Hall of Silence. Here's something, but I think it's actually on the other side of the wall. Tevinter Banner, which we kind of already have, thanks to the Nug, but good to know. The Shard's on the other side of the wall, so I'm not really going to bother with it. Yeah, I hear good things about bear, um, giant, maybe. I can't remember. But uh, nug two? Question mark. Can't wait to fight all these demons. This one's still locked. I think you can get in there. I thought you could. I don't remember. I love like the the pieces of ceiling that are just in there. A lot of good stuff. The Lurium Sigil works well with a barrier focus mage. Hmm. Is this a door we can... I think it's just a door, but you can't do anything with it. Mosaic piece. Heck yeah. Hmm. So it, how old is this? letter. It's at least after the Steel Age. Oh, it's dated. <clears throat> that could have been easy. So I guess this area is from the Storm Age, but okay, so the ruins were probably made... Ooh, heartwood. The actual building seems maybe before the First Blight, but all of this seems to be after 771 Storm. <clears throat> that looks like what it's piecing up to be. Uh, can't get through there because of all that. Honestly, though, you don't really need sigil. Yeah, I will not be using them just because I don't. Hmm. Angry Warden symbols. Hall of Silence. I think there's, yeah, a guy here. Alright, 
and off to the main hall. The texts describe a chamber. This must be it. Archers are taking pot shots, but I think we can do a fine job at it. Ugh, barriers. I can't pronounce that name? Uh, it's gone now, so I can't either, apparently. Was it Lu Lucanus or something? There we go. Keystone. Yeah, stone for a reason. Keep searching. There may be more. There definitely is. Okay, let's get the ones in the courtyard first. Up there. Will you and Jordan be doing Awakening as well? Uh, we we did want to and planned on doing it. Uh, I think the matter of when is the big question here. I know I can get through here. How do I get through here? Do I hop on here and then go from here? God, the jumping in this game sometimes just the worst. Do I have to get at the climb top of the stairs and then get okay? Let's let's get other stuff first. Um, I the, the problem with awakening is that uh, it's probably going to be after baby because um, it needs a whole new mod loadout. Not remind me of uh, someone. pious bastard wore blinding white armor. Told me my shots veered left. I can see how that describes me perfectly. It was just all that niceness. He was just so. Nice. Nice. Right. I take it you didn't like this person. Sebastian would have taken that as a compliment. <laughs> oh, Sebastian. Um, what was I talking about? Oh, Awakening. The, see, I, the mods that we have for Claude do work for Awakening for the most part. It's just that I there's nothing special for Awakening. So if we go into Awakening... Um, like, some of the, the stuff would still, like, be there. Like, you know, Claude would look silly, whatever. The armors would look oh, another way. But, like, there's no actual head morphs and other stuff. And there's a lot of Awakening-specific mods that, like, are funny, but I don't have installed. Um, so I'm going to have to basically redo a whole mod set for Awakening. Um, and that's going to take a while to do. And there's already so much I, we have to get done before Baby. And uh, I, it, it, we're, we're probably going to take a, a... There's going to be a two-month break in between Claude and Awakening. Um, hopefully with Claude, maybe with somebody else. We'll see how the that world state works out. <clears throat> so we do plan on doing it. Um, we might even do some of the other DLCs. We've been debating, like, should we go back, to, like, maybe revisiting tomorrow and do some of the DLCs we didn't do. But I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll think about it. And we also want to do Mass Effect Slima. Like, there's a whole thing. Okay, I know this is somewhere. I should have been paying attention. I think it's in the other room, to be quite honest. Can't wait to see what you do with Awakening, Anders. It will be worth the wait. Well, I hope so. Well, I, here's the thing. I do like making... I, I do like using mods that are already there. And if there's no mods... <coughs> excuse me, for that person... Um, then I'll ask people to make one or submit something funny. Oh, where is... Oh, wait, it's in the main... Okay, I know where this is. I know where this is. Don't worry about it. We're good. Um, not caught up with Claude. Where are we in the story? Uh, we need to go save the queen. This is where we are. How do I get here again? Can I... Oh, oh, oh. We almost had it. Okay, hold on. There we go. 
it is. Gotta get that warden helmet. Uh, we had to go save the queen. Uh, we're actually probably only like two or three weeks away from the ending, um, depending on how much we piddle paddle. Because we really gotta go save the queen. There's the landsmate. There's the there's the elves, like city elves, and then the end of the game. So really not that much to do. Can someone make a furry mod for Anders? Like make him a cat. Knowing the mods out there, I don't know if that's possible. Is this what they were after? But it'd be funny. It may be bound to whatever magic was used here. Imagine like how much blood that is. Uh, let's examine this thing. Got it. Master Spirit Rune. I mean, we already had it thanks to the Nug, but here we are. This is actually a kind of a cool looking staff too, even though like you can use it on other things. Let's read. A uh, lot of big names. Mm. Alright, let's take the staff. Tempest. Careful. <gasps> I think time's flowing again. That's not what I wanted to hear. Alright, let's go do some demons. Whoa, hello. That was a lot quicker than I thought it would be. I think Claude is going to live to see Awakening. Um, I'm not quite sure. I, I will say you do have to make a con- I feel like you have to make a conscious decision to, like, kill the Warden. Like, it's hard to do accidentally, I think, if you know- if, Like, if you know what's going on. So, I feel like unless there's, like, a silly reasoning where we find ourselves in it, I can't imagine us not- Surviving? I, I I would think that the only reason we don't have Claude survive is because maybe we want to play somebody else. Um, like, maybe we want the Warden Commander in that world state rather than the Warden. Will Claude marry Anora? I don't know. Um, here's the thing with Claude. I feel like we plan a lot of things and then, um, it doesn't work. <laughs> it just... <laughs> because of, like, we... It, it, with Origins is interesting in that, like, you really have to... There's a lot of nitty gritty details you have to get right for things to work. Um, and we mess that up a lot because we're kind of half paying attention, we're joking, we do whatever. Uh, so we, we lose a lot of opportunities. Um, and it's kind of funny to do that. Uh, so I, I think that if, if, if we have the chance, I think we take it. Worse than this? Um, <clears throat> uh, coughing because of baby stuff, not necessarily. I'm sick, I wanna throw that one out there. Uh, but, uh, in, in, in the, the, what we, we would like to have him to marry Anora if he can. Uh, I'll, I'll say that much. Okay, I need to get out of here. Uh, I'm gonna heal up. Oh, this is stupid. I want a clawed face fellow. I don't know why you would, but I appreciate it. They're the worst. It's like a terror demon. Wish I had Sola suddenly. <sighs> the game has become aware of what you're trying to do with mods and trying to stop you. Oh. I think it's trying, isn't it? Okay, let's take pot shots at this guy from across the room. Because we can. And we got a fire staff, so that would probably be very helpful. And... Should probably move a little bit forward. Oh boy. Let's get rid of this guy, because everyone else is concentrated on mine. Oh, hello, friends. Okay, I think we're good now. Is it true that Claude is romancing Zebran? We're trying. Um, I... <sighs> it's done. That's enough demons for one day. Frozen or otherwise. Get that going. <clears throat> Um, we are trying to romance Zevran, most because Liliana is gone. Uh, we, we, Li Liliana left us. Um, Morgan is 
I don't know. Well, we could do Morgan, I guess. I, we just haven't been following it. We can't do Alistair because we're playing a dude. Also, Alistair's a child. Uh, <laughs> mostly the child factor in there. Um, there's actually a whole bunch of modded in romances that we could do, uh, but we have completely messed up all of the modded companions because we just don't have uh, enough approval for them. So no matter what we wanted to do, we could not uh, do those romances. So uh, it's really Zevran or Morrigan. And uh, Zevran is just funny because the sex robot voice. So that's what we've been doing. All right, I think we're done with the Steel Ruins. All right, it's been real, Steel Ruins. Thanks for, thanks for having us. Uh, let's exit to the Western Approach. <clears throat> What's worse is when you're despair demons or your personal demons. Yeah, that. Ugh. I wonder what it would be like to, uh, <clears throat> or not what it would be like, but um, in the fade section of Here Lies the Abyss, instead of like you always get spiders. Like maybe some I don't I don't know how how it would be designed, but the game gave you different you know nightmares or whatever. Um, the stream is glitching out. Oh, okay, hold on. <clears throat> oh yeah. Uh, my upload is terrible. <clears throat> Let's look at this. Um. Okay. How are we doing now? Stream is a little glitchy. Okay. I'm not quite sure what to do here. <laughs> oh, boy. Let's see. Here, give me give me two seconds. Let me alt tab. Thank you. Okay, I'm back, but the... How are we doing on here? OBS is still mad at me. Let's see. <clears throat> Better now? Okay. It seems better. Okay, we're getting to. Okay, what I think what I think happened uh, is uh, the result of um, <laughs> working at home. Michael had to upload some files, <laughs> and it's one of those like, yes, you upload the files. <laughs> you just can't not do your work. So uh, here we are. Uh, it's only better, but seems delayed. Like delay between you. I mean, there's always a delay between me and chat. To be quite honest. Okay, I'm going to keep going because it looks better on my end at the very least. Um, <clears throat> I'm just going to do some unimportant things for right now. That way it's like not that big of a deal. So, let's continue on. 
<clears throat> Black, pink, tea. What are you guys talking about? <laughs> up here? Oh, Paragon's Luster. Okay. How's OBS? <clears throat> OBS is still not saying great things about stuff. Maybe I don't know if that's just OBS being OBS or what, though. Let, let me know if, if things aren't doing well again. <clears throat> okay, Chant Your Trail, what's up? Completed Operations. I don't know why I'm following it, like, as is, because I know where it, it leads up. Buffering for me, but might just be my crappy internet. Eh, it might be my crappy internet too, though, so we'll see. Did the stream just end? It's still going on for me. Uh, so I don't think so. Oh boy. <clears throat> what a day. Okay, I think that's most of the top map completed. So now we're just down here. So let's go do some things over here. The stream is very behind from where I am, though. Like, <laughs> wow, okay. It is very delayed. Okay, let's go talk to this guy, because we have the stuff he needs. Of course, Durin's theory of high dragon behavior is absurd, but... Oh, yes? Did you need something? I have a lot. One tail feather and one batch of intestines, as requested. My friend, you are invaluable. I will certainly note your assistance in my monograph on the High Dragon. I will attempt to lure her out as soon as my background research is complete. The stakes could be deadly. The ancient Tevinters wrote volumes on the study of dragons. I believe they had a laboratory in this desert. Oh, if only their work had not been lost. Truly, the Blights set the field of draconology back centuries. Deplorable. Well, I found a manuscript. I found this manuscript on dragons in an ancient Tevinter laboratory. Will it help you? What remarkable diagrams. Are these chambers of the draconic heart? Oh, if only I could read the script. Do you perhaps know a linguist? Or a Tevinter historian? I don't, but the Inquisition might. I'll speak to our specialists. Mm, we're going to go back to Skyhold, aren't we? I've spotted several dragon signs around the approach. Most excellent, my friend. I don't suppose you noted the wound pattern? <laughs> no matter, I'll look into that later. Andrast is mercy. From what I can tell, the dragon has been moving east and will be scouring the wastes next. Naturally, the dragon's hunting ground is full of miscreants. White Claw Raiders. They've covered the area in traps for Maker only knows reasons. Quite a mess. We passed all that, so I must go. We'll have to speak some other time. Alright. <clears throat> uh, just a whole bunch of stuff we have to do. So... We'll probably go down here and then go this way up to this one and then go back towards this stuff and then... Uh, there's a quest down here we'll get to, too. So, alright, let's go. Um, also need to go to Skyhold before we're able to fight the dragon, it looks like, as well. 
I think a lot of streaming services are struggling at the moment, probably because more people are using them. I can't log into Twitch properly for a while. Yeah, there's probably some funky going on. Um, it, it also doesn't help that, like, you know, more people are on the internet, more people are streaming, like, uh, in, in, like, watching Netflix and stuff, so, like, people's internets are clogged up and all of that. Actually, we're gonna go this way, weren't we? So, just a whole bunch of, just a fun, fun time. How do I get up here? Oh, no, there's... <laughs> I forgot there's another, uh... Oh, boy. What's it called? Shard. Ocularum. Okay. I love Frederick. His fascination with dragons is so cute. It is very cute, yeah. I'm gonna just bypass that guy because we really just want to come over here. Um, yeah. <laughs> the Raiders have great fashion. Also, bye, Aaron. I feel like Sir Pouncelot should just be a potato. I mean, if you have that mod. There it is. Uh, get this stuff. And grab this. See, we're about an hour in. We're doing good. I think we can get to Dragon today. Okay. Hopefully there's not- what could I even be fighting? Oh god lord. At least I'll get the scales I need for these more coats. It died again? Oh, uh, it seems to be doing alright on my end. For once. I don't know. It's- it's- Ugh. This is going to be fun streaming during this time period. Alright. Keep having to restart the YouTube app. Oh, goodness. For once, for once OBS uh, says it's not my fault. Uh, so it's YouTube's. But, oh, God. I don't know. We're going to have to... Oh, boy. <clears throat> it's working now? Okay. Oh, boy. This, it's... This is going to be a fun time for all, honestly. These next couple weeks, because everyone's going to be streaming and doing all sorts of goodies. Okay, I imagine one's probably in here. Yeah, here we go. It just lags for a bit for me. Yeah, I, I, I'm not quite sure what to do about it, because it's not... At one point, there was my internet's fault, I will say that. Uh, that was... Uh, Michael had to upload uh, big files for the company he works at, so he had to do that. Um, but it should be fine now. He said it, uh, it's already been uploaded for a while now. <clears throat> I think it's also just YouTube. YouTube being a butt. Okay, let's go fight the thing. Let's look around. <laughs> well, first let's... Barrick, as much as I do love Luke, we gotta, we gotta kind of deal with these things first. <clears throat> well, I'm fine. Sort of. Now, now we're not as fine, but we're dealing with it. Alright, kids. Be interesting to see how this VOD turns out, because uh, we, we got some interesting things going on here, so I'm not quite sure if, if it's, the VOD's gonna be okay. We'll figure it out. We got Despair Demon. I couldn't even see it. Okay, come on. Ooh. Oh, come on. Oh 
and it's behind a rock now? Cheap. Oh, well, they, they got it. Okay, good enough. <laughs> yeah, that crunch midair was very good. Oof, okay. Okay, well, let's go back here, see what we got. Because that desire demon did, like, just eat it over here. Nothing, though. Okay, let's climb up here. <clears throat> oh, the teammates leveled up. Okay, we can do that in a minute. I think this is the Grey Warden one that Blackwell's gonna like. Good find. Down we go. Down we go. The other one's up here. Okay. <clears throat> There's a couple more things. These are very big skeletons. Warden Jaren. I wonder if we'll ever get to find out who these wardens are. Probably not. Uh, let's see, Black Wall. Just continue down his line. Varric. Let's do the stuff I have to read later. Uh, Vale. We'll do Fade Shield. There we go. Down we go. Now we just need to get up here somehow for the shard which is the best way to do this this one kind of looks like stairs all right good but not okay let's try the other way oh yeah there's a bridge we're supposed to go up this way Then we want to go over this way. That'll give us some approval for both Vivian and Varric. And then we'll have to figure out who we want to bring for the dragon. Who should we bring for the dragon? I, I feel like I kind of want to bring Blackwall just because uh, he's a beast. He might. Yeah, who's going to be your dragon fighting party? I do like Blackwall. I guess my go to party is always Solus, Blackwall, and Cole. So I guess that's who I would default to. But I'm not sure. I'm going to worry about the White Claw thing in a minute because I just can't be asked. Iron Bull because I'm a loyal friend. <laughs> Went with Cast Sarah and Sola. Also good. Iron Bull, like, I don't really want to bring Iron Bull because he is very squishy. Um, I just don't know about him. I feel like I, I would shy away from bringing Varric and Bull and then everybody else I'm pretty open to. Okay, I think Vivian's thing's in this tent. Or somewhere close to it. Oh, yeah. I think that was it. Or not. Alright, that's neat. Oh, Who there it is. All this? Grey Wardens. Around here trembles slightly underfoot. Yeah, there's um, uh, there's something here that hints that this could be near an old god prison. So close, we nearly reached him, made it down to what like a dwarven tig where the song was actually audible, real and thrumming through the air, not just in our heads. It rattled through the lyrium pillars and shook the earth beneath our feet to its dreadful tempo. We lost 30 men in the last cave-in, and the warden commanders abandoned the mission. I tried to argue for the one last push, but the rock is too unstable down there. We'll have to find another archdemon somewhere more solid. So yeah, okay. Um, so there is an archdemon somewhere in this pit. We'll actually sort of go down there in a minute, because there's like some stuff down there. Uh, black wall... Rooms? What's over there? Oh, it's uh, whatever. Oh, hello, Jordan. Jordan, you uh, you just missed all of our stream problems. <laughs> we, we we just had a lot of uh, 
A lot of issues we're, we're riding on, but that's okay. We're still going. Uh, what else is down over here? I don't really care about Lazarite, to be quite honest. <clears throat> uh, now we want to get down there. We're just gonna... And listen to that. I will say if you go down there with fly, fly cam, there's nothing interesting in there. Oh! Oh! Oh, Varric! Varric! Oh, you asshole. I don't think Varric likes us very much. <laughs> Why did you do that? My buddy, my friends. Uh, Cassius. 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 We know... Where do we... Where do I know Cassius' name? I do want to get this bag. But yeah, Varric just tried to literally murder me. Um. <clears throat> there we go. Okay. Well, way to go. Okay, what's this on the Chanter Trail? And then we'll kind of do these White Claw things. And then that'll get us one step closer to the... Oh, speaking of White Claw... We gotta undo their traps, and then we have to figure out the Chanter Trail thing, and then we're pretty much done with the Western Approach minus Dragon. Uh, oh, hello. Peric just pulled a little finger <laughs> with the Sky Door and Game of Thrones. Uh, I, this, I do not... Is she just standing there? See, I don't know Game of Thrones very well. Hey, touch lyrium. Hey, that's our not lyrium. Uh, whatever cloth. <clears throat> Ring velvet. Uh. Okay. Let's go undo these traps. What is when I passing? Paragon's luster. I mean, we'll grab it. So where are these traps? I think, yeah, here we go. <laughs> One. <clears throat> two. Uh, there is a little cave down here, but it only opens up after the dragon, so we'll have to wait on that. Where are the other traps? They look just like big pounds of dirt. Uh, is that one? No, it's a body. Ah, there's the one. So, I thought they were like in a circle type of deal. <clears throat> so let's just make a wide circle and see what we're getting. I kinda don't want to fight that thing just because it's useless. Hmm. Oh, I think I see one up that hill. There's two dragons right here. <clears throat> I mean, there's two dragons. Oh, you mean like the little guys? Yeah. Let's try trap. See, other one on the other side? What exactly is the difference between Paragon's Luster and Silverite? Um, ooh. Just let him down. I think my power is just down there. Uh, in lore, Silverite's supposed to be better. Um, I don't even know if we have anything on Paragon Luster in, like, the series. Silverite's supposed to be, like, the famous, expensive thing that, like, everyone wants. Um, I don't know, I don't know game mechanic-wise. I think Silverite, you are able to, like, make armor out of it, and then, like, you can make warrior armor for your mage and that type of stuff. Oh, we'll get this. <clears throat> Pretty sure Silverite protects against poison. It's probably something like that, yeah. We don't want to go down there. We're, miss we're just missing one. Oh, is that it? Yeah, it's over there. Okay. So, Katie, butterfly from DDR for Dragon Age 4. I, as a joke, I will say should yes. thank you, my dear. Better to face us than the high dragon. Actually, probably, yeah. 
<clears throat> uh, now we want to go down here. Actually, let's do on the Chantry Tail. Oh, kill the White Claws. Oh, now we have to... Ah, man. Ugh. Come on, now. why this uh, quest wasn't deactivating because the white claws were getting in the way. Poacher leader. Oh, they're poachers. Okay, cool. They're continuously frozen, so I don't know why I bothered with that power, but whatever. There we go. Uh, the others I'm not gonna care about. What else do we have? What do we do today? Uh, we did stuff. Um, still trying to get that dragon today, but we'll we'll see how it goes. I do want to get the last on the Chantry Trail. It's not really the last one. Why name themselves White Claws? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not I'm not one of them. Maybe they thought it was cool. The end must be nearby. It is. Uh, let's go get it. Pretty big fans of the drink. I think this came out before the drink, didn't it? I don't know when White Claws were around. I'm really not that big of a drinker. Well, that one up there is trying its best. Inventory's full! Oh, great. Well, I mean, like, that's not that cool anyway, so we're gonna just deal with it. Okay, let's keep going in. One down. And this is where Pheromond was for a very long amount of time. I know, I gotta abandon the loot. I mean, it's... I have to. I have no other choice. But I got a mosaic piece. Uh, deep mushroom, deep mushroom. I probably should be getting this deep mushroom. Wait, how was I able to pick that up? But I wasn't able to... So, yeah, I'm not, like, I'm not going to bother with some of these. We kind of need to go back to Skyhold anyway to drop off some yuts. I still know how I was able to pick up that armor, but not, <laughs> not the swords. <laughs> Wait, what? Katie, sell things. I, we did at the beginning of the episode. Okay, so... Let's go back to Frederick, tell him what we did, go back to Skyhold, sell things, and uh, do the thing that lets us get the dragon fight, and then fight dragons? Sounds good to everybody? Sounds good to me. <laughs> Katie, is there a UI overhaul for Inquisition? Not that I know of. Um, I more than 30 days, I have yet to have not heard of one. High dragon in... Oh, yes? Can I assist you? The raiders are no longer in the way. I've made note of the appropriate spots in the wastes for you to place lures. I must locate my supplies to create the bait. Then we can proceed. Oh, do was the book might not be necessary for we'll the dragon. Well, we'll do it time. anyway. <clears throat> well, I'm just gonna go back to Skyhold because I'm gonna go back there anyway. So we're gonna let's go.
Okay. Book is necessary for dragon? Okay, so what's... I mean, we already did the book. We just gotta go translate it. Um, thing... We'll, we'll just... Inquisitor. Hello. Uh, we'll go do war table stuff now. Go to the undercroft and sell things. And then maybe make any weapons we need. What's the level for the uh, western approach dragon? Is it 15, 16? Uh oh, we're starting. We're starting to get choppy again. Fourteen, sixteen, ten. Okay, there. <laughs> okay, guys, we gotta we gotta choose one of them. Okay. Uh, what do I want? This OBS is not liking what I'm doing. Uh, we're gonna keep going on. Hopefully it's not that bad. Uh, Skyholder Lay. That's not what we want. We want Inquisition Perks. Here it is. <clears throat> okay, so... What would be... We can get Advanced Focus. More Healing Potions would be good. Imperial Court Tailoring. Does that get us more... That does give us more inventory space. I do like that, but we're... It is 14, final answer. Okay, 14. Thank you. Tempered glass flat. Oh, that's just... Oh, adds more slot. Um, that I think we can wait on. It would probably be best to actually go for... More... Focus, to be quite honest. Because <clears throat> everything else is more money-based. More healing potions or... I think I'm gonna go with more focus. Go with that. Mm, advanced focus. Okay, got that checked off. Uh, and then Orlay, we probably have a whole bunch of stuff. What's this? Translate the dragon tech. Oh, this is like one of those. Okay. Who's this? Oh, I don't know who this guy is. Um... Okay, cool. I don't know what voice to give him. <clears throat> Ambassador Montelier, I have been considering your last le 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 letter <laughs> as I do. You owe a debt of gratitude for handling the Cumberland incident. I think I found something that may solve your mystery. I have an acquaintance in Minrathus who has a brother in the Circle's College of Antiquities. A few favors, but he may be able to translate your ancient text. But I should warn you, there are likely to be constant fa costly favors. Still, this might be your most promising avenue. You are sincerely, Baron Maxwell von Servant. Serant. A favor for a friend of a friend can get a manuscript translated by an expert. Sure. Okay, esteemed Ambassador Montelier. Enclosed, you will find a completed translation of your fascinating manuscript, which our scholars estimate to predate the First Blight. The dialect caused quite a stir in historical linguistics. The College of Antiquities would be most interested in further cooperation with the Inquisition should you uncover more Tavine documents from the pre-Blight era. Cordially, Anna, Anna Zamander Vetri, Dean of Antiquities, Menrathis Circle. We're not going to do that now, but good to know. Uh, investigate ancient laboratory we're gonna do. Fisher. Nightingale. The last of the Venatori have left the ancient laboratory in wake of the Inquisitor's attack. We can be sure the secrets have been left behind. Those of the Venatori, the ancient inventors, or both. We should not follow the desert and to bury them. We should not allow the desert to bury them. Uh, what is this one called? Investigate ancient laboratory. Now, where is this on my list? Because I did not look uh, at it when I clicked on it. Um, there it is. Uh, we're going to send Josephine. There are Chantry scholars eager to see the ruins. We could salvage artifacts and earn their gratitude all at once. So we're going to do that. <clears throat> Who is this? Sister Rosalie. Ambassador, please, con please convey my thanks to the Inquisition for their assistance. The Chantry expedition to the laboratory was a complete success. 
However, to say we were appalled by most of our findings would be an understatement. We shall send you the full documentation of our discovery when it is complete. In the meantime, we uncovered a few artifacts of note that still may be serviceable. Maker's blessing upon you, Sister Rosalie. Great. A crew of ambassadors. Oh, it's our buddy! Okay, uh, I think for the rest of these war table missions, we'll kind of wait. Um, and then for now, let's go do some dragons. Uh, ba -do -ba -do. What else is here? Do we? We don't really have. Tell me the code. Yeah, we'll save all this for next week. <clears throat> okay, let's go to the Undercroft, sort our inventory, call it a day. Go fight a dragon. What's this episode about? Dragon hunting? Uh, for the most part, we gotta sort out some inventory management and then we go do a dragon. Uh, I think for the most part, all of these are just gonna be complete nonsense. Uh, Tempest will save. Yeah. Oh, Ninja Vengeance might be something interesting. Okay, hold on. We'll... Uh, kind of not great for any of them. 213. Yeah, they're all just... Uh, Sarah, your bow is still the best, but you probably need a new one. There's people talking outside my window, and I'm very, uh, I feel very awkward about it, I'll be honest. <laughs> I don't think they can hear me inside, but I still, <laughs> it's still weird. I'm uncomfortable. It sounds like a lot of people. Why are there so many people outside? Don't you know there's a disease going on? Crazy kids. It really does sound like ten people outside. I'm not going to go bother looking, because I don't want to open up my window. But, um, Punisher. Tell them the social distance. <laughs> Fuck off. Thinking about it. Uh, I think that's everything. Armor. Uh, how, how do we get so much VTAR? Is this anything good? I'm not really going to bother with it. Um, accessories. I think I have to finally bite the bullet and do some accessories. <clears throat> Uh, let's sell things first, because otherwise we won't be able to do it properly. That's not what I wanted. Uh, there we go. I got about half of our stuff. Are we s saying the Dom will come? <clears throat> I don't know what you mean by that. <laughs> call the cops. It's a large gathering, call the cops. I, I mean, like, they seem to be gone now. I... I don't know. <clears throat> uh, wait, I did want to actually put something in there. There we go. Alright, let's look at our inventory again. Accessories. Okay, so what belt do I have? So I have one that gives me one plus grenade, which is nice. I kind of like that, actually. I'm going to keep that because I like my bees. Um, oh, wait, hold on. There's, like, other stuff I could do. Guard penetration or life drain. We already have a good life drain one. And then we got superb willpower. Kitty's collar I'm not really a big fan of. So I'm not going to use it. Cassandra. Sundering. Pay oh, I don't know. Yeah, well, I don't unequip that one. We'll give you a life drain one. And then your belt is urgency. Yeah, we can do that. Tell them what was the necklace. Oh, which just wasn't a good one. Sarah. Invasion, that's decent. Unequip that. Give you a life drain. I'm not really fond of any of those. So we're kind of out of rings now. <clears throat> Your belt is a grenade's belt. I think I'll also keep that on her. Mm-hmm, that works for me. Belt of health. Okay, we can do something better than that. Maybe fire resistance? <clears throat> I feel like I want to give fire resistance to Vivian. 
Stagger on being hits. Let's give him that one. Then black wall. Belt of healing is good. Aggression is also good. Uh-huh. Fire resistance. Well, we could do a health. Mmm, the ranged defense, though. Well, let's do a health. Vivian, we're gonna give you... Oh, we're slightly more powerful. The cost of small amount of health. Uh, now nah, we'll do this one. Um, dexterity, cooldown amulet on magic. And I'm not really... I, I think the cooldown modifier is fine. Solace, you got magic. Mm, electric focus, okay. Barrack, melee defense is fine, good. Cunning, that works for me. Bull, we would want you to have a belt of health, but you apparently already have a better one, so we'll... All right, we'll just get rid of the rest of these. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of Kitty's Collar, because I just, I'm just not a big fan of it. It's fine, but, <clears throat> yeah. We're getting a lot of money. Um, I'm happy about that. Sell this. We still got a lot of this stuff. We're gonna sell, sell, sell. Uh, and we got two runes. Spirit and a clean cleansing. We'll put those on something. Who doesn't have a rune that could use a rune? Iron Bull needs a haft. We don't have a haft to put on there. Um, could put one on Bianca. We can do cleansing rune. Sure. Why not? Solus has a rune. Vivian doesn't have a rune. Put the spirit rune on there. Yes. Good enough. All right, now we can go. <laughs> Bye, Kitty. Yeah, really. Okay, so who do we want to bring to go fight a dragon for the next 30 minutes? Let's see. World map. We want to return to Frederick, so we'll go here. Um, okay, we, we do want to bring Solus. We do want to bring Blackwall, and then the Rogue. I could go either way. Sarah, we've brought before. I don't want to bring Varric. I might do Cole. We'll do Cole. <clears throat> bull for sure. We're not doing Bull. <laughs> yeah, Blackwall, we will actually want to win. Our, the first dragon we did, uh, we took Bull with us, and that was a nightmare. Have you done... Viz Vin Sommer yet? I, if that's the, I, I, I don't know the dragons. My names very well. Um, if that is the one that uh, is in the Storm Coast, we have not, because um, uh, we we actually just got the ability to unlock it. So that that will be in an upcoming episode, but not today. Hello. After more than thirty days, I have yet to observe the abyssal high dragon in. Oh, yes. Can I assist you? My people have translated that to Vincent manuscripts. Oh, studies on dragon hunting patterns, migrations. <laughs> Durant's theory that dragons can't see the color blue is refuted. With those dreadful raiders out of the way, we can finally lure out the abyssal high dragon. <laughs> you should have the honor, my friend. I've made note of the appropriate spots in the wastes for you to place lures. Place this bait and then <laughs> it will be a momentous achievement in draconology. I'm off to plant the bait for the high dragon. I cannot wait to hear your observations. You must make note of how she circles the hunting area. We'll have to speak some other time. All right, I'm going to save here just in case this all goes terribly wrong. Let's go do this. <clears throat> <laughs> Frederick is wearing that getup when it's 120 degrees outside. He's dedicated to the aesthetic. I'll respect that. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta give him some respect, definitely. Also, have we... Have we... How are we, how are we doing on... 
collection landmarks plains on the coast on the plains oh yeah we haven't really gone there yet hinterlands and the oasis do we not have one for western approach i'm confused with that one but uh we want to go regions okay we got them all crestwood we're missing one in crestwood I'm going to go through here. There, there's a lot of things. There were Probably the next episode is going to be a uh, catch-up on all the quests episode that we missed. Um, that's a whole other issue. Okay, so let's... Why would you think they couldn't see the color blue? I mean, uh, what's what's with... Uh, I mean, like, that's... It's weird things like that is, is common, I feel like. Um, what's the one that, like, bulls see red better? It's not really that it's red. It's that it's movement. <laughs> that's what it is. Um, like, like, weird stuff like that has been all over everything for, uh, animal sciences. Someone wore a blue shirt and didn't get eaten by a dragon. Eh, you know, honestly. Could be it. Alright, here we go. We should probably, um, get into, like, a nice position to, like, see. She's coming. I don't know where she comes from, to be quite honest. Why well, she'd be like behind me. There she is. Oh, I did not, I did not. Oh God, I didn't, I didn't level up people. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Souls has two whole points. Uh, this would actually be a good time to do one of those. Um. Your attack slip pass, armor to find a target's hidden vulnerabilities. Straight, great, do it. That was close. That was very close. An impressive creature. There is a purity in such undiluted power. Don't throw fire at me. You're a fire dragon, right? Oh crap, you're a fire dragon. Oh no, I have a fire staff. Ugh, guys, I messed up again. <clears throat> go. Oh, boy. Level 14. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and just do this. There's a lot of things I should have... I didn't do my potions. Oh, I'm terribly unprepared for this. This is a terrible idea. Well, do you have anything that gets rid of guard? I don't think you do. I should have brought Cassandra. I'm, I am so unprepared. Oh, Jesus. This is going to be a while. Oops. Here we go. He has me in his sights, so I'm just going to keep walking. Oh, boy. So I don't think it'll be much, but oh great, and he runs out of the way. Oh, it's still hitting him though. Sort of. Ooh, I do not want to be where his tail is. Really, a codex had a shame if you're prepared for a dragon for life. Yeah, really. Uh, that's me trying. I like. 
I, I, here's the thing, I talk and I read the chat at the same time, so like I forget things I need to do. And then there's also a time element, so I'm like, all right, I only have so much time, I'm just gonna go ahead and go. I think I have everything, uh, and then why I'm battling, I feel like how much I don't have. Um, we're doing all right though, to find out. Like, we're almost halfway. Um, can I weaken him with this? No, he's immune to it, okay. I think all dragons are immune to stats at that time. Bowl is frozen. How long has Cole been frozen there? I think his leg is wounded? Oh, I don't know what's going on right now. Why is it swinging on this? Yeah, now that the uh, Cole's back in the fight, wow, we're uh, suddenly doing a lot better. Wow. Look at Cole being healthy. Oh, great. Oh, come, come back here. Oh, God. Okay, come back here, but don't go there. Uh... God for bees. Aimless blade. Ivory hollow figurine. We did it! Woohoo! -hoo! Oh, he. The dragon. Dragon gender doesn't matter, guys. Come on now. <laughs> We're talking about lore, but like, I'm just gonna call it whatever. I'll call it Tom, whatever. Whatever it is. <clears throat> Everyone send bees to help Katie. <laughs> well, too late, Jordan. The bees have already helped. The what? I only needed the one bee, apparently. All right, what's down here? I think there is a. Yeah, this is like something for a dukin, I think, if I'm remembering correctly. Like a an a dukin warden. Mosaic peas. Ooh, there's two of them. What is it? Yeah, Durna Duncan. Paragons among wardens, brothers and sisters, we honor your sacrifice. So Days, Torsig, Arn, Karaka with no so she's probably castless. And Gavorn. We know most of those. <clears throat> Cole does a lot more credit. Yeah, Cole actually, uh, we were going kind of slow there, and then because Cole was frozen, I didn't notice, and we finally noticed that. Uh, started winning more. <clears throat> okay, uh, I think we go report back to Frederick, and we're mostly done here. I feel like um, we should have gotten all of the uh, mosaic pieces here, and we're missing two, so. They're probably somewhere we missed. Um, but yeah. Nothing to report, sir. Frederick, what's up? Frederick. Of course, Durin's theory of high dragon behavior is absurd. <laughs> You've said this like six times, oh. man. Yes. Did you need something? The high dragon attacked me when I planted the bait. I'm afraid it's dead. She attacked. How wonderful. You had a first-hand view of her behavior. Did you take any notes on her aggressive posturing? I suppose you wouldn't have. 
no matter. I should very much like to interview you. Uh, at a later time, of course. I could join your Inquisition. My expertise could be of use, and your scouts could help me find other specimens. Sure. Certainly. I'm sure the Inquisition could use the Draconologist. Excellent. I'm sure my research will be of great use to you. Woo. Um, all right. And I think that is most of the things in this area. Um, so let's see here. What do we have? Oh, we're not doing that. Great. <laughs> uh, collections. Astrariums. We finished all of these, really. Bottles. Hydra. Yeah. Landmarks. The mire, the plains, the coast, and there should be one for. We 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 missed one in the the uh, the coast. Oh wait, I know we know that one is mosaics. We have one more for the archdemon, and then a couple more for there. Regions. I think we finished these for the most part. Shards. We have all of them there. Yeah, got the shards. All right, cool. So I think right now we're going to very quickly head over to the Forbidden Asus and use the shards that we have. Because um, I think we can do some of them. <clears throat> I probably should look it up before I travel there, to be quite honest. Okay, let's let me look at the Forbidden Oasis. We need twelve. Okay, so we'll go to the cold, and that's the only one we can do. But that's something. Nothing to report. Nope. We get the blood lotus. Because we just use up all of our bees. Um, we're kind of getting to the point though where um we're kind of really set for the next big story mission. Um, I'm thinking that for the next episode is a cleanup episode where we go around and I'll have to do some background homework to make sure we have everything. Um, but we make sure we have all the companion quests done. I think we mostly do. We just got to clean up and talk to some people. Um, but yeah, try to do the companion quests, um, and exhaust their dialogue. Uh, go around to the east of three areas because we, for the most part, we have cleared the western approach, um, the Forbidden Oasis and Crestwood. Uh, we just gotta make sure we did everything. And then we do have to do some more things on Storm Coast. Um, which actually includes a dragon now I'm thinking about it. So this might actually take two episodes. Mm, I don't know. Uh, this The, the clean, clean up time might take up longer than I would like. Uh, but then we'll be able to do... I'm, I'm gonna like give a, 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 a generous estimate of two weeks of clean up episodes. Just because of that dragon. And then we would be able to do it. I don't know. It's uh, <clears throat> or uh, do uh, here lies the abyss. So that'd be fun. Uh, we want to go here. More dragons. Yeah, we'll. Uh, we we also my my favorite items in the game in the uh, bikini mail. We'll have to we'll have to get to. I think it was the cold one that we haven't unlocked yet, right? Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Of course, of course I go right to the loot. Oh, 19 in electric, so bring all the spirit powers. Oh, great. Level 19 is definitely a lot... Mm, we might not actually be able to do the dragon. Uh, hmm. Hmm. I don't know if we should fight it under... What's our level now? 16, I think? 
Okay, we might do dragon after here lies the abyss then, if it's level 19. I don't know. Or, or we can attempt it if you guys want to see me struggle boss my way through it. What, what would you guys be interested in? There's, oh, here it is. <clears throat> well, Morgan have her son in this playthrough. Yes, he will. Uh, <laughs> yes, he will be there, and then yes, she will have the son. That's what I meant to say. Okay. Woo. Struggle! Oh, thank you, Sarah. Uh, and I think I, I like what? Maybe have, yeah, four. That's not gonna work. All right, that's okay though. All right, back to Skyhold. <clears throat> yeah, the electric statics are, and like I'm also like a lot of my powers are electric based and I don't have a lot of the uh, skill tree for um, <laughs> uh, the, the spirit one yet. So I don't know. Uh, let's see, hold on, what's my level currently? 16. Yeah, we could probably... We might be able to get to 17, but that's still like two levels under. Oh god. Yeah. Maybe... Mm, we'll see. Okay, well it's not even gonna be this week. Let me... We'll think on it. I'll say. I guess it depends on how much stuff we have to do. Um, we have about 10 minutes left. Um, I'm kind of started and ended early, uh, for reasons. But, um, we, we didn't really clean up after Bull's quest last week, so let's go talk to Bull, see how he's doing. What's up, man? What? You wanted to see me? Bull! I got it! Yeah, yeah, my soul's dust. Yours is scattered all over the ground, though, so... Ugh. Sorry, boss. I thought I might need backup. Guess I'm not even worth sending professionals for. You knew the assassins were coming? Little change in the god rotation tipped me off. Why didn't you tell me ahead of time? You go through years of Ben Hasrath training to hide facial expressions when I wasn't looking. See? Like that. If I'd warned you or the guards, the assassins would have been tipped off. Are you alright? Fine. Hurt myself worse than this fooling around in bed. What if they used poison? Oh, they definitely used poison. Sarkamek. Liquid form. If I hadn't been dosing myself with the antidote, I'd be going crazy and puking my guts up right now. As it is, it stings like shit. But that's about it. Are you interested in getting some payback? Against who? The entire Ben Hasrath? Besides, this wasn't serious. Sending two guys with blades against me? That's not a hit. That's a formality. Just making it clear that I'm Talvashoth. Talva fucking Shoth. Are you going to be all right? It's a knife wound, boss. I think I'll live. I'm fine. Thanks. <sighs> anyway, I'll get this cleaned up and let Red know what happened. Boss, whatever I miss, whatever I regret, this is where I want to be. Whenever you need an ass kicked, the Iron Bull is with you. Well, and that was that. <clears throat> I think... Oh. Oh, Cullen. Did you need something? Oh, I thought... Uh, I thought you were doing your Lyrian thing. Should you require anything, I'll be here. Right, well, this is just awkward. All right. <laughs> I think we're done with Bull for a while. Um, actually, I think most of the time... In the bushes. All 
right, Bull, how you, what's up, man? I can't understand how those women in the kitchen can be awake so early after the night we had. Oh, Bull, please. <laughs> uh, we'll ask this later, because quite frankly, we don't really have the time. See you later, Bull. Nice talking with you, boss. And then Krem, what's up, Krem? Shame the alliance with the chief's people didn't work out. He hasn't said anything, but he's feeling it. Can you think of any other tasks suitable for the Chargers? I suspect Haven's quiet by now. Might be worth sending the boys back. We could recover some supplies, get an idea about the enemy's strength. We could even pick up any stragglers who haven't found Skyhold yet. I wanted to talk about you, if that's all right. You know, I'm from Tevinter. Wasn't a slave, but even citizens have it rough if they're not majors. I was a soldier, but women joined the ranks under a different program. When they found out I was passing, it got ugly. I ran, met Bull near the border, and ended up here. Not a life I'd wish on everyone, but it'll do. You said you left Tevinter when they discovered your secret. Women are allowed to serve, but only in certain ranks and disciplines. I was up for promotion, but the healer I'd bribed to sign off on my physical had to turn to a sick magister. When the replacement healer saw what was or wasn't in my pants, he made threats. It was slavery or death, so I knocked him out and ran. I'm surprised you escaped from the Tevinter Imperium so easily. It's not like I lived in Minrathas. I was in Trevis, not far from the Navarran border. It helped that I was being chased as a deserter, not a runaway slave. Slave hunters only get paid for what they catch. They're efficient bastards. It's against the law to pass as a man. It's a crime to lie on an Imperial application for service. Would have been a heavy fine or slavery. Ten silvers, the healer said he'd tell the Tribune I was sick in the head. Some pity for the mad little girl. That was when I hit him. I'd served for a few years. I was good at hitting. <laughs> Why did you decide to live as a man? I didn't decide anything. I've been like this my whole life. My parents wanted me to marry up. They tried to find me a nice merchant's son. Every day, put on a dress, look into my father's shaving mirror and just... Hate myself. If you had the chance to use magic, would you change all the way? What? No. I don't want any magic like that within ten yards of my body. When I was younger, I could... Ah, oh, I don't know. Everyone has silly dreams. In Tevinta, dreams like that get you killed. Bull helped me make a good life. Nice armor and a well-placed sock, and I'm happy. <laughs> uh... How did your family react when you started? My mother wanted to throw me out. She said if I didn't marry well, I was dooming the family to slavery. She was happy to take the money I set as a soldier, though. Not that it mattered in the end. My father. When I was little, he'd angle his mirror down so I could pretend to shave, just like him. He never said anything, but I think he knew. What's That's Tevinter sweet. like for a citizen? Someone who isn't a slave or a mage? I'm of the separati. Citizens who aren't mages. Mages are in charge and everyone knows it. But a wealthy merchant can have an easy life. At the low end, people just try to stay out of slavery. My father was a tailor. I joined the army after the Imperial slaves drove him under. How did slaves drive your family out of business? My father made shirts, aprons, that kind of thing. Nothing fancy. One of the magisters had a pet project to prevent the poor from dying of cold in the winter. Nice, right? He had Imperial slaves making simple peasant clothes and selling them for almost nothing. That Magister's nice idea put out slave-made clothes at prices my father couldn't match. Uh... It sounds like the Magister was doing it out of kindness. That's the worst part of Tevinta. People don't even realize they're taking away your living. That Magister wasn't a terrible person. He probably saved slaves from dying. My father sold himself into slavery. He's one of the service publicus, the Imperium owned slaves now. We'll talk later. All right, well guys, with that, I think uh, it's about time to end it. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, next week we just try to do a lot of cleanup and then uh, hopefully we can get everything we wanna get done in one week. That way we can just Worship. do Here Lies the Abyss. Um, so I want to do Here Lies the Abyss in, like, one episode and not, like, split it up. Just so, like, it's easier that way. <laughs> and then we can finally decorate Skyhold like we want. It'll be so nice.
Uh, stream is lagging hard. Yeah, we're, we Michael had to upload some files again, but we're about to end anyway. Uh, I just want to make it to the top of this tower. We're so close. 